Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today we're making corn chowder. This soup is so creamy and delicious. It is also super easy to make. So let's get started. We'll start with our usual trio, onions, celery, and carrots. Some garlic and potatoes. A couple of bay leaves. You can use other herbs like sage or thyme if you like. I'm using canned corn today. You can use fresh or frozen corn, of course. We will need some vegetable broth and a little bit of heavy cream. In a large pot, heat up some oil and cook the onions, celery, and carrots for a few minutes. We want the vegetables to soften up, but not brown. Now we add the potatoes and garlic. Cook it for about two minutes or until the garlic is fragrant. For reference, this entire process of cooking the vegetables would take about five minutes. Lightly season this with salt and pepper. Now we are ready to add in the broth. You want to add about two cups, just enough to cover the vegetables. I'm also adding in the water from the canned corn. Mine only has water and salt in it, so it is perfectly fine to use this liquid. But do check the ingredients on the can before deciding whether you want to use it or not. Finally, we add the bay leaves. Cover and cook for about 10 minutes or until the potatoes are cooked through. Now would be a good time to taste and adjust the seasoning. Before adding the cream, we move the bay leaves. Keep the heat on the lowest possible setting while you stir in the cream. You can turn off the stove after the cream is all mixed in. We will parade this, so let it cool off for about 5 minutes before doing that. This looks perfect. Now put the heat back on the lowest setting and add in the corn. The corn are already cooked, so we are only warming them up here. If you are using fresh or frozen corn, cook them before adding them to the soup. Adjust seasoning as needed. And this is done! There you have it! a creamy corn chowder. I hope you enjoyed this corn chowder recipe. If you like what you see in this video, like, share, comment, or consider subscribing to my channel. I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.